Curiosity about the future is common to human nature. We all want to know what's going to happen, and when it comes to Bible prophecy, people always ask, how much time do you think we really have left? Or the other favorite question is, who do you think the Antichrist is, and is he really alive today? In fact, speculation about the identity of the Antichrist has gone on almost throughout church history. Uh, the early church wondered if it was Nero. Uh, then later people suggested maybe it's Charlemagne or Napoleon. In the 20th century alone, there were all kinds of guesses about who the Antichrist might be. Some said, well, it's Mussolini. He's in Rome and he's trying to revive the Roman Empire. Others suggested, well, it's Hitler. He persecutes the Jews. And if there was anybody that was kind of an archetype of the Antichrist, certainly it was Hitler, but he wasn't the Antichrist. Then others said it's Stalin, a communist. He hates Christians and persecutes believers. Still others said it's Gorbachev and Khrushchev. Khrushchev pounds with that shoe at the United Nations and says that he wants to bury us all. Then others suggested it was President Kennedy. Uh, Gorbachev became a favorite speculation because he had that spot on his forehead and some people actually suggested it's the mark of the beast. Today they suggest it's Putin. I even heard somebody say once that it's Ronald Wilson Reagan because there are six letters in each of his three names. And then others have said, well, it's Bill Clinton and Hillary's the false prophet. 